One interesting um, point that came out from the study was we did see a correlation between um, two, f really two factors in the risk of second cancer. So one of the um, strong predictors of second cancer risk was tobacco exposure, which we know that tobacco um, leads to a risk, increased risk of cancers including lung cancer, bladder cancer, but I think that's an important point for counseling patients um, with CLL, whether they're receiving BTK inhibitors or otherwise. Um, and the other point that came out was that we saw that the, a low CD8 count at baseline um, was associated with risk of second cancer, developing second cancer, and that's something that in CLL hasn't been demonstrated to date, but points to the close correlation between immune function and the risk for second cancer in this patient population. Um, and I think that's an interesting finding that warrants further study as well.